Yo there guys, what is up Luke is and today we are back in Alsa's lovely world and today we are going to be making some minecart rails, going to the underworld and going back to the dungeon where we did leave a bewitching table. I believe that's what it was called. Hmm, was it? I don't know, I, I, I'm not actually sure what it was called. Somebody told me anyway that uh, if I go back and get it, it will let me have like two summons without having... Without having to have any extra gear, basically. So I can have, like, two imps in. Which would be really cool. And I really love that. So, we're going to go get that today. I don't know if it's, like, a duration thing. But what we need to do on the way is grab a load of wood. So that we can make minecart rails. And you might wonder why I'm making minecart rails. And the reason why I'm doing that is because we're going to go fight the Wall of Flesh soon. Because I really want to get into hard mode. And uh, the Wall of Flesh is going to be a very, very hard battle. But, one big thing is um, I've been watching Arkanaut's videos recently, and he really inspired me to do a minecart track. And he's really good at building his, like, amazing, like, with, look at this, look, look at this, look at this, look at this dude. And then you look at Arkanaut's buildings, and it's, like, crazy. But, like, he has a, a real, like, knack for that stuff, whereas me, I'm not very good at building, but we will do some builds, like, later on. But, yeah, anyway, so today, like I say, we're going to go back to the dungeon. The dungeon is this way, right? No, it's... No, it is this way, right? Yeah, it's there. Okay, yeah. So we need to go back and get that table. And once we've done that, like I say, uh, we will then go ahead and, well, make some minecart rails and go fight the wall of flesh. And that's what I'm going to do in the next few episodes. I'm going to be, in this episode, like I say, doing that, getting the minecart rails, maybe placing a few. And then in the next episodes, we'll be placing a few of the minecarts. It's going to be lit. It's going to be awesome. It really is. I cannot wait for it personally. So, yeah, I'm I'm just so stoked to finally fight the Wall of Flesh. Because getting into hard mode on um, expert mode is very, very good on its own. But then, it's like the experience of hard mode as well that's also really cool. Because, of course, uh, when you're in hard mode, you get the hard mode bosses. They can randomly spawn in. Uh, you, you get loads of good accessories. You also get to, like, increase your gear. You get wings. What else do you get in hard mode? Uh, you get a load of cool gear, basically. Loads of new weapons, ultra-powerful things, and uh, we also get to unlock the Uzi in hard mode. And the Uzi is something I've been meaning to get for ages in hard mode. On this, anyway. Because, uh, well, I've been wanting to get either, not meaning to get, because I've, I've not been in hard mode yet, so I've not been meaning to get anything. But, yeah. So, basically, a big shout-out to Arkanauts. Like I always say, he inspires me a lot. Um, his motivation for YouTube is sort of where I get my motivation from at the minute. Because he posts so much and he just inspires me to do more. Um, and honestly, it's just so good. And, you know, you inspire yourself with things, you know, that you really enjoy and really like. Uh, you surround yourself with, you know, positive people, positive things. You do things you enjoy. And if, as long as you follow that, then eventually uh, you, you'll go follow on as well and... You'll just be doing well, and honestly, it helps out so much seeing, like, Arkanaut's videos, again, inspired from him, and then, like, do my own sort of thing from that. Um, like I say, the minecart rail thing will be, like, copying, though, so if anyone comments, like, oh, Arkanaut's did this the other week, why are you only doing it now, Look, you're so slow? Well, I don't know, it's just, I don't know, okay? I just always feel scared to fight the Wall of Flesh, it's one of my biggest fears, and I don't know why, it just, it just is, I don't know. I don't know why, it's just so random. But yeah, once we fought the Wall of Flesh and got that out of the way, all the hard mode stuff's quite uh, quite straightforward, luckily. So yeah, I'm just hoping that the Wall of Flesh don't prove to be such a bad fight after all. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping. Right, that was a death son. Right, so we're looking around for this tape. I don't actually know what it looks like, by the way. It's just uh, your comments that I've been reading. Saying that I left like a, a table or something. That I need to go back for it. So, and what I've done is I've favorited all these things as well. Because a lot of you guys were saying, Luke, why don't you just favorite things? And, uh, yeah, I did that now. So, yeah, you can't complain that I haven't favorite things. Another thing that people keep telling me to do is get rid of the hot bar And, uh, get, like, quick select so I could just heal straight away. And I was thinking of doing that. Uh, but I don't know yet. Maybe I'll enable it in a hard mode and see how that goes. But... We'll just have to wait and see. But for now, we're just going to roll with this. And uh, we're going to go down here, like I say, and go find, hopefully, uh, that table. Curse Skull. Last time I got a Nazar off there. I'm not going to get a Nazar again, am I? So, <laughs> you know what it is. Right, here we go. Beautiful. 
I need to find- Whereabouts would the table be, though? That's what, what I'm thinking right now. I don't actually know where the table was. It's just that someone said in the comments, Luke, you've left a really important thing there. I was like, really? They're like, yes, you have, Luke. You've left a really important thing. So I've got to go back and get it. Because I don't want to miss out on the rest. Apparently, it's quite a rare table to find. Uh, but there's like one in every world or something like that. I think that's what someone was telling me anyway. But I don't know. I don't even know if you can craft it. I think it's something you have to find in the dungeon. Again, I don't know. I'm not... Uh, it's a 1.3 item. Again, I've not played much 1.3. Um, apart from using a lot of previous gear. So we're just going to have to roll with it and just hope that we get one. That's not it, surely. That's a normal table, okay? We're looking around for it. We will get it. I hate how Angry Bones could just break through. It's so annoying. It's so, so annoying, isn't it? There we go. Beautiful. All right, so we gotta be, it's got to be close by, surely. Because I didn't actually go that far down here. Come on, where's this table then? Hopefully I didn't mine it up. That's one thing that I'm, like, quite worried about right now. I think I might have mined it up and left it in the last episode. And if I've done that, then I've lost it forever. Because, um, obviously it'll be disappeared, won't it? But I don't know exactly what I'm looking for. That's the problem. Pretty sure that's the, no, that's a, just the table. Got a golden key there as well. Beautiful. Got some... Uh, yeah, I love that. See, see, uh, the, the the magic book's amazing. The water bolt even. Not the magic book. The water bolt's so good. It really is. It, it's such a good weapon. And even in hard, early hard mode. Even in early... Uh, what do you call it? Yeah, early hard mode. I got it right. I was going to say, even in early easy mode. <laughs> no, even in early hard mode, it's such a great thing. Especially having it celestial as well. I might reforge my... Right, is that it? Is that the bewitching table? I don't know. Let's mine it up anyway. Yes, it is. Okay. So, yeah, you can have more minions by pressing B. So, I'm, I've only got one minion, though. Can I, like, summon more, maybe? I could summon two. Can I summon a three? Oh, no, I could summon two. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Be careful, Luke, be careful. Woo. There we go. Oh, my. I thought I was gonna die there. I really did think I was gonna die. I almost am dead, aren't I? Why am I not using a potion, the noob? I'm such a noob. Right, there we go. Beautiful. There we go. The bees, the bees. I think that's gonna be my go-to weapon. Ooh. I didn't see this before. Got a cash pile there. Isn't it? Is it not? Oh, I wish bag of bones. Oh, that reminds me. That reminds me. Oh, I need to put these in here. I don't want to be losing out on that much. I've almost got one platinum, man. Madness. Right, okay. Let's go home and see if we've got lead. Hopefully, I didn't sell it all because I think I did sell it all, to be honest. Right, there we go. All right, so we've got the bewit bewitching table now. And it looks like it lasts forever, right? I don't know if it's got a time on it. The imp will fight for you. I can't see a timer on it. But there may be a timer on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, keep it on me. So that uh, I can use it anytime I need to. Because I, I like to have two minions. It's very good to have two minions. Very, very good. Like, seriously. Really good. <laughs> Alright, do we have any lead or iron? I can't remember if I've got lead or iron in this board. Don't have any there. We have tungsten. I think I sold all my lead and iron. I'm not going to lie. I'm an idiot if I did. I think I have. <laughs> I've sold it all, haven't I? <laughs> oh, no. Because I sold all my things at one point to get gold. So I could buy some stuff from the shop. And I'm pretty sure I've sold all the... Oh, no. No way. We need to go get iron then. Iron or uh, lead. That's what we need. 100%. 100% we need that. We've got sturdy fossil there, but I'm not going to use. Splunker potion. We'll take that. Right, we'll, we'll take that. Boom. Right, let's go find some iron and lead then. I shouldn't have used it there. But yeah, let's just go right underneath us. I'm sure we can find loads. Like loads and loads and loads. I've, I've even been loads. That's the worst thing. Wait, have I got any in here? No, I haven't got any in there either. It's the worst. Ah, oh, I'm such a noob. I am such a noob. Yeah, I have lead because there's lead down there. But we're going to just go and go down here. We'll go down here. Sweet, that should be, it should be a good spot. Is that lead right there or is that tin? That's tin. Oh, an underwater chest. 
I never knew that was there. Recoil potion. I'll take those. That's about it. Right, is that, that that's lead though, isn't it? Yeah, that's lead. All right, cool. We can get the we can get that easy. And uh, we don't we don't actually need damage to be fair. Wait, what was that killing me then? Is there a zombie there? I can't see a thing. I need to get I need to get something that can light up the place. That'd be very very nice if we could get that. Not just uh, torches either. I mean like something proper to light up the place. I think that's just tin. Yeah, we're not gonna go. We're not gonna go far there. Basically, we need to go get into the place where there's like no water. That way, we can probably mine a bit faster. Right, if we mine all the way down here anyway, we should be good. Oh, there's some there. Beautiful. All right, we'll get that batch, and then that should be good. We should be able to make quite a few bars by the time I've got my um, splunk potion gone. I think I got four minutes with it. That's how many? We should get five or four, four or five minutes. Yeah, I think that's right. Right, sweet. Let's put a torch down. There we go, beautiful. And, um, yeah. Is this okay, guys, with the zoom? That's what I wanted to wonder. That's what I've been wondering for a while. Is the zoom okay there, or is that too far out? Because I know when you're watching on a screen, it's like, okay. But then, like, if I zoom in like that, fair enough, you can see a bit better. But I can't see very well. So I need it about there to, like, see decently. But I know you guys can't see very well there. So, yeah, just let me know in the comments below, anyway, if that's okay. No, I, I'm okay watching on, like, a computer screen, but I understand if, like, you're watching on a phone, it'd be quite small. And that's uh, my worry about those things. So hopefully it's okay, guys, and that you can watch it. I mean, like I say, I, I can watch it fine. I can watch back fine. Even PC users have to do it that big anyway. So it's not, like, a problem, I don't think. There we go. There's a, there's a zombie going to come in here. That's why I started shooting those. My minions should take them out, right? Yeah, I thought so. That's what I'm talking about, baby. I probably just wasted a load of time. I could have just gone down like a random hole. and probably got a lot more uh, lead than this. But no, for some reason, I've decided... You know what? Yeah, I'm just going to go down a random hole that I've already built. Because... It's like, yeah, because there's probably a lot more there, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. There's even more underneath me, you know? There's probably more down here than there is in the whole of the map. So we're going to go down there and have a look now. Alright, we've got to go around. <laughs> Clearly forgot. Bit of a noob I am, aren't I? <laughs> but yeah, we've got the bewitching table now, which is amazing. Like I said, I don't know if it's got a timer on or what. Or if it just, like, permanently allows you to have it. Comment below if you know, because I can't see a timer underneath the picture. It's, like, very faint in the top left-hand corner. Uh, but yeah, I can't see a timer there, so I'm assuming it's uh, unlimited. But, again, I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. The Splunk Potion's still active, luckily. So, yeah, I'll be able to see all that beautiful ore. We're going to go downwards. Should be faster mine this anyway. Yeah, there we go. See what I mean? I've already found more than what I have doing what I do. <laughs> we got loads of lead. Yeah, we, we should be able to get enough uh, to make loads. And a minecart. Oh, a minecart as well, though. Minecart takes like 10 or 15, isn't it? Pretty sure it is. A life. Why can I have a splunk potion before? A life crystal right there. Right, is that uh, tin? Or is that lead? Oh, that's lead as well. Beautiful. I'll take that. I'll take that. No problem. You give me all that lead. You give me all that lead. Any more? Oh, pot. Destroy the pot. All right, cool. What, you, we, nah. I was going to say, you know what? We could just mine these. But my car tracks are like really cheap to make anyway. So it's not like we're going to struggle to make them. It's just the fact that find enough lead to actually make them all. Because we're going to have to have a, quite a few mine car tracks. Not going to lie. We're going to need a couple of hundred easily. Because like I said, when I was watching Arkanauts do it, he had such a long minecart track. And I don't know how he built all that. But yeah, I'll probably have like a time lapse build in mine. Or I might do it all like off camera. And maybe have it like as a time lapse while recording. And then we can fight the wall of flesh when we do that. That'd be, that'd be awesome, wouldn't it? Have a little, uh, little, little good old time lapse. I love time lapse. Time lapse is so fun to watch. I love it. <laughs> you just see people being a noob in like times 10 speed. <laughs> Definitely me. Right, okay, let's um mine down here. Beautiful. It's a bit more lead in our pockets. If that's what you want to say. Not really in our pockets, but you you get the gist. Alright, it's pitch black down here. Let's put that down. Beautiful. We are we are rocking this right now, guys. Absolutely rocking it. Right, lead. How much lead have we got so far? Right, okay, so we've got 106 lead, which should equate to about, I would say, if I've got to put a number on it, 
I would say it's going to equate to around uh, 20, 27 bars, maybe. Something like that. Maybe we can get some bars out of these uh, chests as well. Since I've got like, 86 gold, I'm going to definitely reforge things as well. Celestial is the best for that, though, isn't it? Is Celestial the best? Or is Mythical the best? I think it's Mythical, isn't it? I might just keep Celestial anyway, um, and then reforge everything else. Agile is quite good for um, a pickaxe, because it makes it faster. So it's always good. Unless you've like, got an endgame pickaxe, then you don't really want that, but... Is this one we haven't explored? Nah, surely. Surely we've got this one. It's in the middle of... Oh my! We haven't actually explored it. Huh. That's pretty cool. <laughs> we didn't even explore that. Pretty sure we've already got a loom at home as well, so we don't need that. But there is some lead up there as well. That's pretty much what we come for, the lead. There's an orange blood root there too, so we'll take that. That'll make us some orange dye. Very nice. Very, very nice. I will take that all day of the week. You bet I will. Alright, this is the... Oh, that's tin. And that looks like platinum. Sure we'll have enough bars anyway. Honestly, I really think we've got enough, but we're going to have a look anyway. We're going to have a look. If we need more, we can come and get more anyway, which is not really a problem. Not a problem at all. Now, do you make it a crafting bench or do you make it where? All right, cool. We got them anywhere. No, they're not showing on there. Pretty sure it's wooden. Oh, lead bars, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, Let's just get rid of all our junk anyway. We can pretty much just quick stack it in the chests because I've favorited everything. So we'll quick stack in nearby chests. There we go. And I'm pretty sure that's everything we don't need, right? Hopefully. Uh, I think. <laughs> I'm just going to hope it. Hope, hope so. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just going to hope so. <laughs> All right, cool. We're good. And now we can make the lead. Let's go make that beautiful lead then. How many is it? Is it three or four? I think it's four to make a bar, isn't it? you not make it the furnace? Oh, I know what I've done. Have I actually got a load of lead up here then? Have I really got a load of lead up here? Lead, where are you? Where are you, lead? Now I've got loads more of it. I could probably see a bit better. It's got to be in one of these chests though. I don't know. Where, what? I've deposited it. I've quick stacked by nearby chests. So it's got to be somewhere, right? No. You guys are going to absolutely murder me in the comments. <laughs> you are. You are, you are, you are. You're going to say, Luke, you should have kept your chest tidy. Luke, it's right in front of you. <laughs> Something like that. Something along the lines of... Uh... <laughs> that anyway. Oh, no. I didn't trash it, did I? But I... I, I... Oh, there it is. 210. All right, yeah, we did have a bit then. Sweet. Who else saw that? Come on. Come on, own up. Who, who else saw that and didn't tell me about it? You guys. You guys. Ugh. <laughs> Joking. Right, cool. Let's make it anyway. What? Oh, there we go. Lead bars. Let's just double check. We can make the rails now. Wait, we can't even make the rail. Wait, 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 wait. Is it a craft? Is it an anvil? Yeah, okay. We make 50. 50. 50. Jeez. We're going to make a bunch. Are these three or four? Oh, there's only three, which means we can make tons. 70. Yeah, boy. You bet. You bet. Now we need to make a minecart. Yeah, don't mind if I do. Yeah, baby. There we go. And we can put that in here. Bomb. And then we need a light pet, don't we? We really need a light pet. I've still got two. Yeah, that, that's infinite. The bewitching table, definitely. That is infinite for sure. Like, it's so cool as well. Okay, now we need to make the minecart track, don't we? We're just going to make, uh, maybe like, um... Should we just make it all into minecart tracks? See if we don't really need it. Do we need to make them all into minecart tracks? <laughs> well, I've done it now anyway. <laughs> so you can't have a choice. I've done it now. All right. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Oh, man. I am, I am. I am a silly moo, aren't I? Moo! Moo! <laughs> oh, man, I'm weird. Right, let's try to reforge some stuff then. Alright, let's go to Goblin Tinkerer. Where are you, bro? Here you are. Alright, Fad, how you doing, man? How you doing? I need to, uh, upgrade some stuff, bro. 
I want to get better defense on this. How much is it to even reforge that? I don't even know, bro. But you best reforge it to a good one. 50 silver, is that it? Uh, we... Oh, wait, no. No, I've just realized. Uh, plus three damage. I want... Ah, uh, uh, critical... Nah. It's not taking much to reforge. How much money do I have? Does it say anywhere? Oh, yeah, 81 gold. Okay, cool. No, 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 no. I'll take a plus four anything, but uh, critical. This is chomping through my gold right now. Chomping through my... Oh, plus four damage. That's actually quite a good one. Oh, look at all of those. Whoa, you get loads. They just all popped up. Lol, if only I obtained all those. All right, I've got to look at it properly then. So this is plus three movement speed. That's okay. Plus three defense, that's okay. Plus three defense, that's fine. Plus four damage, that's fine. All right, we're good, we're good. I'm, I'm okay with that. Can we reforge anything else though? Maybe my... You know what? How much is it to reforge my water bowl? I'm tempted to do it. It's just I don't want to get a worse one. That's the problem. Two gold. YOLO. Come on. Ah, oh, I'm going to run out, aren't I? No. No. Hurtful, no. Manic. No. Annoying, no. Zealous, no. Demonic. Ooh, that's good. No. Ah, uh, Mystic. Mystic. Is that the best? Mystic? Taboo? Wait, was Mystic the best? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? <gasps> mythical! There we go. It's mythical. Mythical's the best. <laughs> oh, Agile's fine for that. Uh, what about the bee's knees? Yeah, we can reforge the bee's knees, can't we? Unreal! <laughs> I'll take it! Unreal! First, 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 first shot! I'll take it! No, I'm gonna complain about that. Imp stuff. Murderous. Adept. Pretty sure it's mythical as well. Lazy. Demonic. Murderous. I'm just... Ah, oh, Masterful! We'll take that. I'm pretty sure that's the best one you can get. Masterful. So that'll do a bit more damage now as well. So that's a bit more damage now. We've got Unreal Bee's Knees, which is sweet. What does it actually do? Plus 15 damage, plus 9 speed, plus 5 critical hit, plus 10 velocity, and plus 15 knockback. Man, that's cool. That is awesome. All right, we've got our minecart rails. So am I right in just thinking that you place them down... And then you can ride on them, right? I think that's how you do it. I'm pretty sure. Yep. Yep. That's all you have to do. Literally just that. Wee. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Yeah. Right. Cool. Yeah. yeah. We're we good then. We're good. We can probably make some of those. Uh, make, make some, like, do some of that. I do want to do that. I might work on that soon then. Yeah. I mean, let, let's go and uh, assess the situation anyway. Let's go to the underworld. We can go, get there quite easily by using our little uh, route down here. It's not a halivator quite as such, but it, it goes pretty much all the way down. So we're just going to go and have a quick look before we end the episode there. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that I've got the bewitching table. That's the main focus on today's episode and getting minecart tracks. So the next time we can probably, yeah, like say, get the minecart tracks to do it and then kill the wall of flesh. Oh, it's going to be such a good fight. It's going to be amazing. Really, is with my um, full molten armor as well. I'm all decked out. You can't reforge armor, can you? No. I was thinking, can I reforge armor? Be a bit stronger? But no, you can't do that. It'd be really cool if they added that into the game. You know, it's so, uh, like a, a real full feature. Because you can get it through mods, but it's like then you need mods. And I don't mean mods as in like bad mods. I mean mods as in good mods. As in the, the right way to mod. Not the, the quote unquote wrong way to mod. Because people... People uh, mod things and it don't make it as fun. You know, you know when, I don't know, you can have god mode or something. I mean, you can get mods like that on PC. But what I mean is the mods where you actually hack, like hacking mods and not modding mods that add content onto the game. Like Calamity, for example. Take that as an example. That's the sort of mods that I mean. I don't mean like a proper full-on mod. Oh, that grass is a nice color. Is that uh, mushroom grass or what? It's a nice colour, anyway. It's going mouldy. <laughs> Just mouldy grass. That's what it is. Yeah, but the Unreal Bees Knees is awesome. I want a light source. You, I think the only light source you could potentially get is the uh, Bloody Heart. And you can only get that by destroying... Mm, nice. Uh, by destroying the 
Crimson Altars, and I don't know if we've got any more left. Oh, no, I do. The Crimson Hearts, even. So we might go do that in a minute. Try to get a Crimson Heart, because uh, it just follows you around, basically. And uh, it's really cool. I don't actually know if it is a drop, actually. From I'm, I'm pretty sure it is a drop from when you destroy the Crimson Heart things. Better get some Teal Dye with that mushroom back there. So we'll go and see if we can do that in a sec as well. And see how uh, hard the Brain of Cthulhu is now as well. Because we're pretty decked out now, aren't we? Like, we're pretty uh, suited up. I'm, I'm pretty sure the I, the I of Cthulhu... The Br Brain of Cthulhu would be a little bit hard still. Even even with all this gear, I, I, I'm going to say it's probably going to be a little bit more hard. But again, it's not bad. We're going to actually go faster with this one as well now. Which is really awesome. Wait, was this even the way we had to go? No, it wasn't. We need to go down here. All right, on the mine cart we go. We're ready for this, guys. Oh, I'm thinking of doing the, one of these across my whole map as well. Oh, is that it? Well, that was fun. Pfft. Really? Oh, it's because it's the one underneath. Makes more sense now. Right, go, minions, go. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's go into the one underneath anyway. We can't teleport. I was going to say, let's teleport down there. And then I realized we're not even in hard mode, so we can't even get one of the teleporters for it. <laughs> let's teleport down there. Yeah, nope. I don't think so. All right, cool. Let's um, keep going anyway. And see if we can get down into the underworld and assess the situation. And I don't know how high I have to build. Because I'm pretty sure the, um, the wall of flesh actually comes to your height anyway. So regardless of whereabouts I build it, I'm pretty sure he evens himself out to where you are. As long as you're not too high or too low down. So he should be good. He should be lit. There we go. Sweet as a nutcracker. There we go, lovely. There we are. We're here now. So now I just have to do that, and that, and that. Beautiful. See, that's a little bit, that little cheeky boost there. Little cheeky boost. <laughs> there we go. Sweet. Let's jump over here. There we go. Sweet. I think that's my favorite word, you know. I think sweet has to be one of my favorite words ever. If you if you had one pound for every time I said sweet, you'd be a millionaire by the end of this video. <laughs> right? You probably would. Take him down. Beautiful. It's a shame this isn't auto-fire, really. If it was auto-fire, it'd make the bee's knees OP. Because it's OP as it is anyway. But if, if it was auto-fire, that'd be amazing. And by auto-fire, I mean you just press like RT down and it fires, but... Yeah, it doesn't do that. Alright, there we go. Let's go over here. And then, we just have to drop down here, don't we? I love that. That biome's like one of the best biomes ever. Oh, honestly, it is. It looks amazing. I thought the mushroom one looked cool, but the fire one looks absolutely fire. Get it? But I'm sh Oh. We've come the wrong way. We've come the wrong way. No. Why have I done this? Why have I done this to myself then? There's a Skeletron there as well. A Skeleton there. Not Skeletron. <laughs> yeah, a Skeletron there as well. A random Skeletron floating around. Alright, I need, I need to make a elevator, don't I? I'm going to do that soon. It's just, just a thing that goes all the way down to the underworld. It's beautiful. Oh, well, I could have got lead from down here. Could have told me that I left a load of lead down here. To be fair, I should just look back on my episode and just look for lead. <laughs> Would have been much easier to do, really. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good. We're good. Whoop. 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 Lovely. Whoop. The problem is, is there's so much lava down here. Oh, oh wait. Yeah. We didn't get a shadow key, did we? Or do we have one back at home? Because we've got two shadow chests there, but I'm pretty sure we never got a shadow key from our chests. Unless I've got it back at home. Which I might do, you know, unless I've got it in here. <laughs> Oink. I don't have it now. I need to go find a shadow key because I need these chests to be opened. And you're supposed to get a shadow key out of, like, one of your first chests. Which I never. So it's, like, really strange. I honestly don't know why I didn't get one. Right, yeah, I think what we're going to do is we're going to build the minecart, like, there. Do you reckon? What do you reckon, guys? Can we, like, we can hang on the minecart as well, which is beautiful. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. There we go. Oof. Oof. Just about healed there in time. Oh, these, these enemies are a lot stronger than I remember. A lot stronger than I remember. They, they really are. 
Yeah. Don't look like I can actually hang on to the minecart either. Which is going to be really annoying to build then. Oh, actually, you can sit on your minecart, can't you? Come think of it. You can do this, and then, um, like, build. Uh, pfft. Well, that was a mess. Okay, I don't build minecarts normally. So, excuse my newbie minecart building. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I wanted to just assess the situation to see what it'd be like. But no. Can't even do that because of these newbie little enemies. Go away. Go, go away. No one likes you, enemy. Go away. Please go away. Please go away. There we go. Oh, there we go, lovely. Alright, now let's go on here. And we are going to do that. Alright. Let's get rid of that. Nah, we've got to go home. I ain't risk. I am not risking it, okay? I am not risking that. Right, yeah. I'll probably build one of them. Like, so I'll, I'll work on building one of them anyway. I'll maybe make it into a time lapse, as I said. And let's go and see if we can get that heart that I wanted anyway. We're going to have a look if that's down there. We just have to destroy demon heart, uh, demon heart things to get them. Or crimson hearts. So I forgot what they're called. And then you get a little crimson heart following around. It basically it just lights up the whole area. So it's like really, really nice. And I think it is anyway. I think it's really, really nice. And that's why we're going to go get one now. And hopefully, as I say, we can actually get one. Because I don't remember if I can or can't get one. Because I don't know how many I've got left. I'll just have to see, because we're going to probably summon in a brain of Cthulhu, which I don't really want to do, because it's going to be dangerous. It really is. <laughs> we're almost here now, anyway. We've got, we've got a few down here. We'll take them on. See, see how it goes, isn't it? <sighs> so happy I got that bewitcher table, you know. <laughs> so, so happy. Right, there we go. There, there's loads of meteorites landing here, too, which was, like, crazy. I found that mad, how, the amount of meteorites there were uh, in... This world, it was insane. It really was. Just over here now, and it should just be on the other side. Yeah, okay. We just have to go with this sand, and we are there. And we are going to drop our mixtape. It's going to be like, yeah, I'm in the crimson. I'm killing antland swarmers. They're going to run from me because I'm cool. None of that even rhymed. Please just uh, find help for me fast as possible. None of that rhymed. I can't rhyme. I got no time. I gotta run away. And it looks like the bewitching table has actually run out. Unless I just have to summon another one in. Oh no. There we go. Okay, cool. It's summoned in. I was gonna say, the, the bewitching table's gone. And then I realized, nope. It hasn't actually gone anywhere. It was just being me, me being a me. Basically a noob. <laughs> Where's my crafting table down here as well? What was I doing? What was I doing down here? I cannot remember. Probably getting killed as normal. Let's get through here. Beautiful. Alright, there's some hearts just on the other side of this. We, we, we should be able to take these. Yeah, we can take them on no problem now. Remember when we come down here and we were so weak that we couldn't actually take any of these guys on? And I just died, like, pretty much instantly? Yeah, I remember those days. And now look at me. Now look at me. Super OP guy now. Alright, there's one just here. Thing is, I don't know how many I can spawn in before a brain of Cthulhu is going to spawn. That's a problem. Because I don't know how many I destroyed. So I'm going to take a potion just in case one just randomly come out of nowhere. Please give me it. Should we get some, uh, that's a musket. We don't want the musket. Just make sure, yeah, we've got enough space to pick things up. I know you probably can't see much right now, guys. Chill goes down your spine, which is the th First one, yeah? Oh, we've got the end of Scream Echoes around you. I don't know if it's a drop, you know. It might be a drop, and I'm, I'm getting it, like, completely wrong. Maybe it is a, maybe it is a drop, then. Yeah, it, it could, could quite be a drop, and I've just got it wrong. Come on. Why is this not working? I was say, it's no water. Should work. There we go. Sweet. We've got a Gills Potion there as well. We've got loads more down here. What am I doing? Why do I take, like, the most awkward ones ever? Let's light up the area a little bit. Nice and lit up there. 
we go. Use the water bowl as much as we can. Good, good, good. Keep the water bowl in on action. That's it. Keep it coming. Keep it coming, baby. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Right, let's destroy this one here. And I know a brain of Cthulhu is going to spawn after this, so I don't know if to teleport out or whether to fight him. We'll see. Ah, oh, Crimson Rod. Should we take that anyway? No, we don't need a Crimson Rod, do we? All right, Brain of Cthulhu is there. So what we'll do is we'll just spam these. We'll just see how it goes, I guess. There we go. Oh, we are destroying him. But he, he's took a lot of life off us. Don't get me wrong. He's took a lot of life off us. We just need to get a bit more bouncing around going on, I think. Bit more bouncing around on the go. As soon as that one's destroyed, I think he's going to go crazy, isn't he? Got to be careful here. There we go. He's crazy now. He's crazy. He is crazy. Yep. See what I mean? There we go. Oh. Let's get the water bolt in action. As long as we can get that in action, we should be all good. Oh, God. He's doing loads of damage to me. Which which one's the real one? Which one's the real one? Oh, no. He's going to kill me. He's going to kill me. I can't see... It. Oh, no. It's getting really confusing. I can't tell which one's real and which one isn't. Which one's the real one? I died! No! He was so close to dying! <laughs> I am such a noob. I didn't know it. I couldn't see which one was the real Oh, I got a sword as well, don't I? I'm an idiot. Why didn't I get my sword out? Why didn't I get my sword out? I don't know. I just felt like I was super overpowered. And then I, I realized my life was going down quite fast. And I wasn't as overpowered as I thought. <laughs> well, it's okay. Don't worry about it. We're going to go back there anyway quickly. And just uh, break the rest of them. And we'll fight the, the last bread of Cthulhu. <laughs> oh, man. If only my water bowl lasted a little bit longer. That would have been awesome. The problem is, as well, about the Crimson, is that enemies just come out of nowhere as well while you're fighting. And that's the most annoyingest thing that can happen. I tell you now, it is the most annoyingest thing that could ever happen. Right, we need to put our bewitching table. Yeah, where was my minions? My minions weren't helping me then. At all. Oh, we need a three space, I think. Is that oh, no, there we go. All right. Got an extra minion as well. If, if only my minions did a bit more damage, I could have easily killed him then, I think. Easy. Oh, I should have just took a like an iron skin potion there, or or even even a thorns potion would have been all right. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take a thorns potion next time because when he hits you, you're doing damage, and I need to like sort of focus on uh, going forward and backwards like this. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that that's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. So yeah, let me let me know if you like these long episodes well, because I'm gonna keep this one long. Normally I cut them up, but I'm gonna keep this one a bit longer. See if you guys enjoy it. You know. Probably won't watch the whole video, which I'm fine with, because the bewitching table was sort of the focus on this episode. But if you do watch the whole video, do uh, comment pancakes. I don't expect anyone to type that out. That's the most randomest thing ever. It's near the end of the video, so if people do skip near to the end of to this point, then I guess they will put pancakes. But for those true viewers who watch the whole videos, I love you guys. <laughs> I love everyone anyway. It's just, you know... The people that do watch all the videos, I really appreciate it. It does mean a lot. And uh, the support you leave on the videos, the likes you leave, the views, all that stuff, it means a lot to me. I can't I can't stress enough how much you guys make this channel and make it cool and, and all the all the cool stuff that goes on in the comments. You're all so kind to each other as well, which is which is awesome. That's that's what I like to see, you know. That is what I like to see. Okay. So we are down back down here now and we're gonna take down those hearts. I'm really hoping that it's not a drop. Because if that if that's uh if it is a drop and I've just wasted a brain of Cthulhu, you know, I wasn't taking it too seriously. But now if it is a drop, then I'm done for. I'm not even joking. But we'll, we'll get these last few anyway, and then once we've got these last few, we're out of here. We're outy. We are gone. Gone for good. Oh, these hearts there as well. Are you kidding me? Wow. Wow, there's hearts everywhere. How come I didn't pick those up? I think I was just in a bit of an awkward position, weren't I? 
No idea why I didn't pick them up. Whatever, anyway, we're good, we're good, we're good. Let's take this one down. I'm pretty sure you get a heart from these, from destroying these. That's a panic necklace. We don't need that. I'm not bothered about things like panic necklaces and things like that. I really, I really don't care about those. I just want the, the bloody, I think it's called a bloody, um, a bloody heart or something like that. I, don't, I can't remember. Panic necklace again. This panic necklace is the only thing it's giving me. Or at least it feels like it. Alright, we're going to get one that's down here. Let's put a few torches down so you guys can see what I'm actually doing. And then we'll, uh, we'll go back and get these. So this time, I'm prepared. I'm going to use the Thorns Potion when he starts going crazy. And I'm going to actually get my sword out as well. I feel like a bit of close combat isn't going to hurt. Go. Mm. Alright, let's just do that. Alright, cool. Let's do this. Come on. I'm hoping it's not a drop and it is um, and it is from the the hearts, because I got a feeling it's gonna be a drop for some reason, I don't know why. You know where you just have that whoa, whoa, why am I going really slow? These guys slow you down then. They must give you, yeah, they give you a slow debuff, don't they? Fair enough. Completely forgot about that, to be fair. I'm not going to lie. Is it going crazy already, or? It is indeed going crazy already. Can't even get near me. It can't even get near me. Although, to be fair, it will do in a minute, won't it? If I can just keep it away. There we go. There we go. Hey, Brave to the Loot and Feared. <sighs> Why is that so, so, ah, uh, so hard? I don't know why. <laughs> it's not even that hard. Where's the, where's the treasure bag? No, no. I want my treasure bag, please. Okay. I want my treasure. Oh, there it is. There it is. Right, let's see if it comes from here then. We'll open the treasure bag and see if we can get it. Have a look. Brain of Cthulhu. Yep, we don't want that. We'll probably sell it for quite a bit gold, but... Yeah, I'm pretty sure you do get them from these hearts. We'll destroy a few more. See if we can get... Get it from these few. Because there's only a couple left anyway, and we could probably fight another one easily. I, I can't believe I missed out on that first one, though. It's not even hard. It's just I'm a bit of a noob, okay? Bit of a noob, especially when it comes to yo-yos as well. Panic necklace again. Is that what you get from these guys? Panic necklaces. I don't want a panic necklace. All right. Stop giving me panic necklaces. Give me what I want. <laughs> Give me what I want, man. Please. Please, I beg you. All right, let's go down here. We're going to drown if we don't be careful. It's probably best to get this one so we don't drown in the... Another... Cr I want a crimson rod. Okay, I don't want a crimson rod. I think there's one just down here. Get up there. Beautiful. Is there one more? I think there's one at the bottom of here, right? I think... No? Huh. No. That's all of them then, isn't it? Or is, is that one? That's a pot. That's a pot. Have I really destroyed them all? Wow, I have. They've all gone. I have got some more on the other side though, haven't I? For sure. Why can't I just get one of those? All right, let's see how much this is worth, actually. I just want to see how much uh, this panic necklace is worth. Don't know. Don't really see. You can have all the tissue samples in that as well. Might as well just sell them to him because I'm not going to use them. Crimson. Oh, my. That's a lot of gold right there. <laughs> let's just uh, put that away again. Boom. Lovely. All right, let's, um... let's smack that in there, that in there, that in there. 
Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Have we got any more over here? No, we haven't. We actually haven't got any more. We've only got one. Unless... Oh, no, we've got a crimson there as well. So then, guys, that has been it today. Hope you enjoyed. If you do want to see more episodes, then do remember to leave a like on these videos. I've slowed them down a bit because I don't think a lot of people get notifications. So hopefully you are now, and uh, I'll be back and ready to go. Hey, guys, have a nice day. Have a great week, and I'll see you next time. And I'll just put this here. There we go. And we'll remember, that's there, guys. We get two, what do you call it, it's from that. Yeah, minions. <laughs> Please leave a subscribe. Stay frosty. And peace.